Is your device running out of storage space and you just need a little bit more room? Then this from Kushan will solve all your issues. So the packaging looks very generic. I'm guessing they use the same packaging for all the SD cards and micro SD cards. It basically is black, it's orange, it says high speed memory card, high efficiency and performance. The back is multilingual. You've got English, Dutch, Italian, Spanish and French on there and looks like possibly Japanese as well. But it doesn't actually give you any specifications of the product itself. So you wouldn't actually know what speed it is unless you were to look it up online. So inside the box, all you've really got is two pieces of plastic which hold the adapter as well as the micro SD card. The adapter turns the micro SD card into a full size SD card. So if you wanted to use this in like a standard camera, like a DSL camera or something along that lines, you'd be able to do that. That's not a problem and you shouldn't see any speed differences either. So that's pretty good. The card just slots in this little slot there and away you go so it's pretty straightforward now the actual card itself which is rated at doing 90 megabytes per second on read and 45 on the right so that should be pretty good but we'll do some testing in a few minutes as you can see it's got a white and orange look to it to be honest is not much what the coloring or the style is going to do because they're all the same and they all fit obviously the device is exactly the same but this is a 128 gig version and we're going to see well if it is actually any good or not especially for the price okay so this card is a uhs free card which means ultra high speed version free which means it can transmit or should i say read write at 30 megabytes per second and well it does that with ease maybe the results are slightly different than what it says on their website slash amazon it says on amazon that the read speed is 90 megabytes per second and the write is 45. in our testing we used atto first on the read we actually only got 78 on the read close to 79 megabytes and on the right we got round about 55 which is faster so you're getting 10 less on the read but 10 more on the right in all honesty right is the best thing to have a higher speed on anyway because when you're taking pictures with your camera or recording hd 4k footage and so forth it's right into the card not reading for the card even though the read speed on a lot of devices is the main thing what's actually shown on the box because it's generally higher it's actually the right speed which is the most important to most people especially when you're doing creative content now we did the test again using crystal disc mark as you can see here the read speed we got roughly 81 on the read so similar sort of thing just a fraction higher and the write speed we actually got 65 which is actually well 68 in one instance that actually shows it's running roughly 20 nearly 25 megabytes per second faster on the write, and again just less than 10 slower on the read than stated so I wouldn't say that it's a failure or such because you're actually getting a lot better write speed and again speed tests depend on software what's been used to test it as well as hardware and so forth we know we're not limited on our stuff because we've done tests of 300 megabytes per second and higher devices using sd cards so we know it's not an issue our end and the machine we're using it on is like a 24 core 64 fred fred ripper pc just to give you an idea so we've got no bottlenecks that way either but overall, I'd say I would actually recommend it, even though the reads are slightly less than what they should be, the writes are a lot more than what they should be, and that more than makes up for it. So yes, I would recommend this product. I hope you enjoyed this video, and know I did. Why not check out one of our other videos by clicking this box up here, or this one just down here. Otherwise, you can give us a thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment below, let us know what you think, and we'll see you next time.